In this tutorial, we're going to do keyframe animation using Motion Builder. We first import 11. In the navigator window is currency empty. This is because we have not yet selected 11. Go to the character control window and select the 11 character. Now the parameters of 11 appears in the navigator window. Again, we reset all properties as usual. We move to the dupe sheet window and try to create a keyframe here. What we wish to do is to create a, a keyframe for the right hand, so we select the right hand. And in the dupe sheet window, we right click and select key at frame. And then press the key button in the pop-up window. A keyframe will be created for the right hand. And then we move forward. And here we create another keyframe. Notice that because we are using body pass IK, when we drag the hand, only the limbs related to the right arm will move. We right click at the dupe frame group sheet window and click key at time again. And we create another keyframe. So now Motion Builder will interpolate to keyframe and create an animation. Let's do the same for the right leg. This time, we try to use the rotation controller to create a keyframe. First, we select a frame, right click, key at time, key. And then we use, we select another term. We use the keyboard shortcut R to toggle the rotation controller to generate another posture and create another key. Now, both the right hands and the right leg are moving. Obviously, you can right click on a key and select delete to delete it. And you can also selectively delete the translation component of a key or the rotational component of a key. Now we try to make a keyframe with the full body IK solver. We use the left hand key it. And make sure you have selected the full IK solver. And then we create another posture. Now the whole body will move because we use the whole body IK solver. And select your key. You can see that now we create another part of the body movement.